Yeah, yes, little bugger. Yo, what's up, guys? It's James here from Magasaka City, and today we're going to be playing Blackout from Black Ops 4, showing you my first gameplay, first impressions of how this is. And I'll be honest, it is my first try of time playing this. So if it's not too good, please, please don't go too harsh on me in the comments. Please. But anyway, guys, without further ado, let's just jump straight into the gameplay. So I've just chosen my character. I can't be any of the zombie characters that's not unlocked yet. I've got me Ruin. That's the guy I play when I play multiplayer. So without further ado, let's jump in and see what this is all about. Right, so we're entering the game. The staging area. Okay. No weapons. I can hear people running, guys. Literally, this is no mess around. You're straight into the game. Oh, sweet. Okay, got some guns now, which is good. Let's see if we can find anybody. Hang on. Oh, wait, this isn't actually the game yet, is it? This is just like a little testing area. Look at you and your red hair, boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on, in. Have some of this. Come on. Yeah, you little bugger. Yeah, I'll have you in four seconds. Yeah, had him blacked out. As a zombie guy, you can pretty guess exactly where I'm going to land. Right, so I'm going to go to the asylum, obviously. It's got a little while to go until I think we should drop out to go there. Okay, let's drop. Let's drop now and see if we can make it over there. Got a little way to go. Oh, yes, mystery box. Let's see if we can get our hands on that, boy. Oh, we're not the only people dropping in here. It's pit. Oh, I can hear zombies already. Brilliant. Whoa, that's not fair. Half the zombies are invisible. Nice. Uh, I know I'm not alone. That's the worst scene right now. Uh, didn't want the zombie after me because I thought it would start attracting the actual people I'm trying to get away from. Okay, so they've just thrown a monkey bomb. Okay. Uh. Uh, okay, that was dreadful. Dreadful for me. Sorry. First game, and I didn't die instantly, which is good. Staying true to my zombie roots, I'm going to land, I'm going to have to land in another zombie location. So this time I'm going to give Asylum a miss, because I've already been there. And this time I'm going to go for Call of the Dead, or in this, known as the White House. Not sorry, the White House, the Lighthouse. Let's go and see what that's like. Six, five, four, three, uh, I might be not, I might not be alone. Let's try and be the first one there. Here we go. Yeah, as I expected, I'm not the, not the only one here. Ah uh, no! No, come on! Right, guys, I can happily say I got a lot, a lot of work to do, a lot of practice to do before I actually become anywhere near to close to this game. But so far. For a battle royale mode, I'm enjoying it, and I'm to be honest, other than Fortnite-ish, I'm really not a fan of battle royale, and I want to play more of this. Each time I get shot, almost instantly at the beginning of the game, I'm like, I want to jump straight back in, which is a good feeling to have when you're playing a game. You want to carry on playing it, not be annoyed of it, and just go, ah, just throw your controller, start smacking stuff around. But anyway, guys, if you could please hit that like button down below, it would really mean the world to us, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Some too, do you? We'll have some of this, boy. Yeah, yeah.